dang it. Oh, what? Chainsaw. No way. The bunghole. The bunghole. Oh. New Bluetooth magnets. Oh, shoot. What's up guys? So I just got done with an eight and a half hour drive yesterday. Well, last night I am here in Arkansas with Bryce. It's time to do some magnet fishing. All right, let's go ahead and get the first throw of the day. This same time last year, we started the clean stream movement here in Arkansas. It's been an entire year. Almost. Almost, yeah. We're about, what, two weeks away? Yeah, a week or two. Week or two, yeah. This is where I started my magnet fishing journey with Bryce. A year later, we might as well circle back to it. Feels like I've got something on my very first throw. <laughs> Definitely got something. Yeah, like the... Looks like the end of an electric motor, maybe. It's got to be with the grates on there. Heck yeah, that's some good weight to start off with. A whole bunch of crusties. Anything cool? Nope. The top of a barrel. Oh gosh. Whoop, whoop, whoop. We got a body down there. Definitely got the top of a barrel. What in the world is this thing? Huh. Body barrel, maybe? I don't know if that applies. I don't know if that's an Arkansas I don't, thing. I don't know. Arkansas might have took some tips from Louisiana and started throwing them in there. Oh, we got the old Ultra Cap. Whoa, what is this? It's like a whole grate. Oh, I thought you had a shopping cart. <laughs> I would have wanted a shopping cart. I'm not going to lie. Oh, here we go. Got a little bit of extra weight. Just a butt. Ooh, this dude's rolling. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the whole thing shook. Oh, man. Dang. Welcome to Arkansas, baby. Right off the bat, man. All right, it'll be all right. Just got some framing. It's like a desk frame or something. Some kind of cover to something or something that locks in here. No idea. Oh, we got something Ooh. all the way out there. Metal bridge. What is this? I didn't notice that oh, idea. I got some head. Dang, something's over there destroying the bridge. Got a brake pad. Got a motor head. Let's go. I ain't worn Dude, down that to was it. Out. Ugh, it just splattered mud all over me. It's all over your face. Dude, you got headers. Yeah, I know, dude. What would that come off? I was like, weld it straight into a glass pack. It'd be good. I wonder if that come off a tractor, though. Kind of looking tractor-ish. Oh, what in the world did we get on that throw? Got the little CO2 cartridge. People out here doing them whippets. Just a bunch of scraps. I got a little small spring in here. It's got a little electric motor. At least I'm getting stuff on every throw. It's just a bunch of junk. Oh man. I can't tell. It's a log. I had something bigger on and it just got knocked off right here. Just a little piece of sheet metal. Probably from a car. Dang, dude, I got a full antenna. Alright, well I got a lawnmower blade and there's a whole sheet of tin right there. Oh worn out. Worn out mower blade. Oh, is it a sign? It's a piece no. of a garage door. Let's see if it stays on. You got it. Got it. Oh, oh, just, oh barely. just in time. Wait, is that a is that a garage door? Yeah. It's just barely on there. You're gonna have to go that second half. Dang. <laughs> well, somebody lost a piece of their garage door, it blew into the river right here. Tornadoes around here. Tornado damage. That's a first for me though. I've never found somebody's garage door. Oh, I got what? a chainsaw! No way! Oh, dude, it's the full freaking thing! I've never found one of those before. Uh oh, I got I got something in a bag. Gee, 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 gee. Oh, we, we got, got, we got, got it. it. I don't know what that is. It's not very magnetic. I thought it was gonna be an oil filter, but it's not really looking oil filtery. Oh, we got an acetone can. We got some fast drying thinner or oil based paint, enamel varnish. Come on, Glock. Nope. Let's see what else. No way. Nails. Oh, what is that? That's cool. Is that a knife? Uh, no, that's an oil filter wrench. Oh. 
That's actually pretty handy to keep. Is it broken? Dang, all right, well. We just getting down to the little bitty scraps of this spot. So clean bridge, on to the next one. I know this is Bryce's find, but I got a lot of car people on here that watch me. So if anybody recognizes what these headers might go to, leave me a comment down below. And this is a bridge that we actually hit last year a pretty good bit because we found a lot of stuff. So you can see something. Yeah. It's definitely lower than it was. Uh, there's a good chance that we still find some stuff and maybe it's filled up a little bit since last year. Let's see if there's anything good here that's been dropped since last year. What do we got here? My very first throw, I got spark plug, oh, a cigarette lighter for a car, and a little pair of hemostats. Yeah, I'm going to stick these in my pocket because these right here are good for the tackle box. I can give them to my kid. He'll probably end up losing them, so it won't cost me no money. What are you doing? It's a what, was that a dragonfly? No, it was a bee. <laughs> this might be rideable here. Let's see. That thing's heavy. Yeah. Let's get that little boost. Oh, dang it. There goes the chain. Well, this feels heavier. It's a big old stick. And some scrap stuff. That might be an old deteriorated seat belt, seat belt latch. Yeah, I think that's what it is because the spring's right there. That's where the button would release it. It's magnetic scrap. It's got some kind of little top. I'm not exactly sure. Just scraps. I'm not feeling too much stuff over here anymore. No, I think we pretty much cleaned this spot out. It ain't refilled a whole lot. What is this thing? All right, so we got some kind of hose that would connect here. I guess transfers out maybe some kind of sprayer mechanism for the tractor equipment around here. Something. I ain't finding nothing, man. Well, come right here. What? Come right here, because I got something bigger. I completely just stole a fine from you. Golly, <laughs> man. I want your help, well, not you for you to come take all my stuff. Help, man. <laughs> not bad. Electrical hey, motor, though. Yeah. Dang, let me clean my magnet off. Oh, I wonder if it's a barrel, because that's the bung that goes on top of it. The bung hole. The bung hole. Barrel bung hole. Oh, I got something. Is that it? It's heavy. You got it, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Got an exhaust clamp, a gear that fell out of this. It's some kind of transfer case. A little exhaust pipe clamp. All right, well, I got a little gear. To some be. kind of little cover. Yo, Bryce, I think I got you something you could wear. You're always in need of a shirt. No. Here's a piece of a shirt. No. But you got something else. Electric motor. Let's go. <laughs> Heck yeah. That's got a lot of copper sitting inside of it. Definitely electric motor. Movement. Comes up just to there and comes off. Just trying to move it. It won't move at all. It's planted there. So whatever's big straight down, I'm not going to be able to get it. Right, jump in. Jump in. Can't swim, remember? Say that. <laughs> what do we got here? Golly. Heavy? It's pretty heavy. Looks like a belt oh, would ride right there. We got it, dude. What you got? Bro, it's cinder blocks. It's just a huge it's piece like of concrete. A, it's a how? That doesn't make any sense. You're, you got a claw hooked in it. Biggest splash to date. Yep. <laughs> Biggest splash. That was a good one. That was one. a pretty good splash. Oh no, I had a radio. Oh. oh, I felt the magnet pull off and the claw get attached. I thought I had it. What, a piece of concrete? No, not a piece of concrete. It was uh. heavily metal. Another electric motor. How come I'm just getting all this junk and you're Ooh, getting, you literally come to my spot to it. Yeah, but man. I'm just trying to get this one thing. Yeah, I'm, uh, my big thing right here ain't moving. Whoa, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I never said I was good at throwing this thing. No way. Here, I'll get Bro, it for you. you. my thing, I'm going to be so mad. Oh. It just keeps getting heavier. Oh! oh. We lost it all. Oh. It was right there. It get out of my fault. This is what happens when you bring it in. It's man, magnet fishing. I know. I had it right there ready for you to what? grab. You no. missed it. A super old fishing reel. Oh, yeah, that was mine. Yeah, that was. I'm going to take one throw over here and pull up the thing you've been trying to get up for an hour. I wish you would because I can't move this big thing. 
What was that? I tried to go under. You know, the key to magnet fishing is going really slow. Oh, yeah, I bet it is. You gotta go really slow, especially when somebody's waiting on you. Mm, bet it is. Oh, Ooh. dang. That looked like it from my perspective. <laughs> that looked like it. What do we got? We got little holes, we got little holes. Yeah, all right, we got a grill burner. Got all the little propane holes around there. Yeah, yeah, I think. What else do we got? No way. Yeah, the little pin come out of this thing and it was stuck to the magnet, come completely off. Well, it's a good thing it came off up here. Yeah, for real. All right, well, how'd you guys just throw the magnet like this? No. no. Oh, okay, clean it off first. All kinds of little stuff. I think Blake's got a, a barrel down there. Huh? No, you got a barrel. How it's mine, you don't want to mess with it. What do you want me to do? I mean, I can't really throw my magnet. If y'all want to get one of our new Bluetooth magnets, hit up battlemagnets.u. <laughs> <laughs> We've had that for like two years. This is what the end of my rope is looking like right now anyway. So I think... It's I, two years of magnet fishing now. I, I think it's time for me to go ahead and retire my rope. I literally have given you the free rope and be like, here, switch it out. And you're like, okay, I'll do it when I get back. No. He doesn't switch it out. <laughs> I like my rope. I'm just gonna turn my rope around to the other side. This was the side that was all frayed out, but there's another good end on the other side and I got a used carabiner out of the car. So we're gonna make it work for today. We're coming back to a spot that we've hit with like four people already at once. Oh, dude. It's still fine stuff is pretty impressive. Yeah, that just shows you how much stuff is here. Put it behind my ear. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Well, we just come down the road a little ways to this other bridge. Last time we were here, all this was flooded with water, but now that it's low, we see all kinds of junk. Oh my God. That is heavy. I think we're gonna have to loop it. Yeah. Oh, I didn't have a good grip. I was hoping you had. <laughs> you wanna lasso that side too? I did not have a good grip. <laughs> yeah, I noticed. Okay. Maybe a lasso again. Let's see what you can do. It's hard though. Oh yeah! Woo! Are we got it. Me? Let's go, dude. dude. Get it. Holy crap! Oh shit! What? Got a wow. treadmill. I'm gonna pull a dead body out of there once. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully not, but. Table. Uh, treadmill. There's a bunch of other garbage down here. We're pulling out. Trying to clean everything up. It's hard work. Yeah. Have a go, man. There you go. And man, I ain't gotta wait to pull it out of the water to see what it is. I'm thinking it's a chair. No, you're right. Let's go. You got it. <laughs> I'm two for two on my coals. I'm gonna take a wild guess here and say shovel. shovel. Oh. One, two, three. You owe me a shovel. Uh, okay. Are the drinks. <laughs> Got the old flat shovel. Dang. It's the baby chair. Some, somebody lost their baby chair. Hey, is this still magnet fishing if we're not throwing in the water? Boom. Whoa. Hey, bro, what you doing? You plan on throwing something in the river. Make sure it's got wheels on it because we really appreciate it being easy to roll around when we find it. Thank you. You think these fans are any good? All right, another fan. Yeah! Oh yeah, got a water spout. Spick it. Now this might be cheating. What are you talking about? <laughs> this might be cheating. You should do this while we're at all the bridges. All right, got a ceiling fan. Hey, grab that in, I'll grab this in. That's, that sounds really heavy though. It, it, it's like almost frustrating how easy it is for that thing. All that work we put in, just like that. Just like that, nothing. yeah. Alright, sounds good. Thanks, man. Have a good day. 960. 1,000 pounds. Good job. Let's go. No, good. good. You good job. Yeah, good job. Yeah, good job. Yeah, good job. Last time I was at this spot right here, I was in my kayak and paddled around the outskirts. We found a bunch of stuff. So let's see if there's still some more stuff here we can get, or there's more stuff. Ooh. 
What do we got? A little pipe on the first throw, and I can't tell what that went to. The the label's then rusted all the way out. What is this thing? All right, I'm gonna clean up my magnet, see if I can get that thing. See if you can hook this. Whoa. Yeah. That is, it almost looks like. Whoa, what is that, dude? That thing's so brittle. Oh, is it like a slot machine or something? This makes me think of a projector. It's cool. If anybody recognizes what this thing right here is, please let me a comment down below because I am genuinely curious. It's like a bike sprocket. Yeah, it is. Bike sprocket from the back tire or the, the rear hub. And it still has a couple pieces of the chain stuck on the sprocket. All right, it's probably an old bike laying somewhere around here. Got a dangler. Right there. A big dangler. There's wood attached to the sides of this thing. I don't know, got a big solid hunk of metal with a little wooden frame built around it. I don't know what that'd go to. Good weight though. What is this thing? Whatever it is, it's heavy. Ow! I smashed my finger on a bridge! Ow! Fuck. A magnet? I hope it's not a magnet. If it's a magnet, this is just staying there forever. Well, I don't know. There's Bobby's forearm workout. <laughs> no, Bobby's forearm workout looks like this. <laughs> Dude, I felt that. <laughs> Yet he can take it. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be it for today's video, and I really appreciate y'all watching all the way to the end. Made the scrap run. I got a little bit over 900 pounds for the day, and... We added a little bit to it. So that works out good to give us a little bit of head start for tomorrow. We're gonna be right back out here doing some more magnet fishing again. So stay tuned for another video. Appreciate y'all watching. Later.